Chapter 3 Field Visit and Report Writing The main objective of a field visit is to collect geographical information by actually visiting a place. Observing various components of the physical and cultural environment, collecting information through surveys, and preparing a report of this visit are the things expected when we make a field visit. In this chapter, let us try to understand how to study these components when we visit a village. Preparing for field visit We must have a notebook, a pencil, a pen, a scale, a tape, etc. besides the sample questionnaire during a field visit. We should also carry a bag to collect samples of different things and materials. If possible, we should carry the map of the village we plan to visit, a compass, a camera as well as a binocular. In order to collect information from different officers, we must seek their permission and fix the time and date of our field visit well in advance. During the field visit, we must take care that we do not cause any harm to the environment of the place we are visiting. Visit to a village Many of the people in India live in villages. Figure 3.1 shows a group of students and a teacher observing the surroundings of a village. Life in villages is somewhat different from that in the cities and towns. You can obtain detailed information of a village from the following sources. A. Your teacher. B. Observations. C. Discussions with the local people. D local offices and E available maps. Questionnaire Use the following questionnaire while collecting information about a village. The sources from which you can get this information are indicated in brackets at the end of each question. Use them. Question 1. What is the name of the village selected for the field visit? A. B. Question 2. Does the village have any historical background? If yes, collect information about it. C. Question 3. How far is the village from your place? Give the distance in kilometers. A. B. Question 4. In which direction is this village located from your place? A. E. What type of approach road is available? B. Question 6. Is there any village panchayat office in the village? C. D. Question 7. Which is the nearest town? A. E. Question 8. What means of transport are available to go to the village? A. B. Question 9. In which physical region are the village and its surrounding located? Mountain, plateau, plain. B. D. Question 10. What is the color of the soil there? B. Question 11. Are there sources of water like river, lake, etc. in the surroundings of the village? If yes, name them and find the direction in which they are located. A, B, C, E. Question 12. What landforms are seen in the surrounding areas? B. E. Question 13. What could be the reasons for the specific location of the village? A. C. Question 14. 
What trees are found in the surrounding area? B. C. Question 15. What animals are there in the surrounding area? B. C. Question 16. What are the types of houses in the village? What building materials are used for their construction? B. C. Question 17. What drinking water facilities are available in the village? What is the distance from which the water is fetched? C. Question 18. What irrigation facilities are available in the village? A. B. Question 19. Is there a primary health center, PHC, in the village? If not, how far is the nearest PHC? Give the distance in kilometers. C. D. Question 20. Is there a school in the village? If yes, up to which class? B. C. Question 21. What means of entertainment are available in the village? B. C. Question 22. What crops are cultivated on the farms? B. C. Question 23. What activities subsidiary to agriculture are practiced in the village? B. C. Question 24. What domestic animals are seen in the village? What are they employed for? B. C. Question 25. What is the population of the village? D. Question 26. What shops are there in the village? B. Question 27. On what day is the weekly market held? If there is no market, where do the people go for marketing? C. Question 28. What activities other than agriculture are carried on in the village? C. Question 29. What items are found in the diet of the people of the village? B. C. Question 30. Describe the attire of the people there. B. Question 31. What fairs and festivals are celebrated in the village? C. Question 32. What means of communications are available in the village? B. C. Question 33. What other facilities are available in the village? B. C. Question 34. What government projects or schemes are implemented in the village? For example, social forestry, village development, etc. D. Observe the sites of water supply and waste management as well as the sewage system in the village. Find the environmental problems that are there in the village. Collect more information about the village through discussions with the local people. Report Writing After collecting information about all these various aspects, it is necessary to prepare a report of the visit. You should try to include maps, tables, pictures, photographs, etc. in the report. Prepare a report with the help of following points. Introduction Location of the village Physical setup Sources of water and irrigation systems Plants and animals Soils Agriculture and allied activities Population Houses, construction and arrangement, occupations of the people, human life, facilities and amenities, inferences and conclusions, acknowledgements, references.